so jawfish are a group of fish that are very rarely kept on a reef aquarium. Actually, they make quite brilliant reef inhabitants for the vast majority of reef tanks. You do have to be a little bit careful if you've got a lot of LPFs on the sand because sometimes their digging behaviour may bury some of them, but other than that, they don't really cause a lot of harm. They also get along with most other fish and despite their big scary mouths, are actually relatively peaceful. Now you'll often see the blue spotted jawfish about, and that's quite an expensive Caribbean species, but they are cool water. They don't tend to survive very long at tropical temperatures, and are best kept in a specialist cool water aquarium with other cool water species such as neon gobies and Kathleen and gobies, if that's what you want to do. However, with the other jawfish, there's quite a wide variety out there. The most popular ones in store here, and certainly the most attractive, would be the barley tiger jawfish. There's an attractive yellow and blue striped body, black head, orange eyes, and orange round the mouth as well. They're also a fantastic fish for a breeding project. They're mouth brooders, just like Bangor Cardinals. The young are reasonably well in demand. The adults take good care of the young, and at the time that they're released from the mouth, they're quite large and can be fed quite easily on a wide variety of frozen foods. So they're a fantastic addition. You do need a good fitting lid with jawfish because they can be quite jumpy, especially when first introduced into the aquarium. And they can also change sex according to most sources as well. So if you add any two together, they generally pair up and get along just fine. They do do a lot of digging, but their charismatic behavior soon carries over any minor disruption they do to the tank. And they should be a lot more popular than they are. So if you do have a reef aquarium from 50 meters upwards, then that is a fish well worth considering and asking about uh, on availability. Check out our other videos in our Ask James series.